Hey, we're in about May, June timeframe of 2022. And one of the big topics, of course, for anybody looking to get a loan is the subject of interest rates. Are they high? Are they not high? What are they predicted to do moving forward? And so I'm here to try to answer a few questions and just kind of give you some perspective and then we'll go from there. I'm Ann Riley Caldwell, not your ordinary agent, realtor here in the Nashville, Middle Tennessee market. And if you like this video, please subscribe to my YouTube channel and hit the thumbs up button and share it with other people. Um, I've done some research on interest rates. I talk to lenders all the time. Uh, right now, interest rates are in for most people the five percent range um, somewhere between five and five and a half percent um, nobody ever knows exactly what's going to happen but um, listening to different economists talking to different lenders um, there seems to be the thought that for 2022 interest rates are probably going to be between five and six percent for the most part small chance they could go a little bit higher possibly kind of fluctuate um, from 5% to maybe the low sixes. Uh, most people think it's gonna stay most of the time between like 5% and five and three quarters percent. The question is, is that high? Well, a lot of people think yes, because we got really spoiled with interest rates being crazily low. I mean, two and 3%. Uh, 4%, I mean, it was just insane. If you compare, you know, the current climate with the 1970s, on average, interest rates were 8.86%. In the 1980s, they were 12.7%. In the 1990s, they were 8.12%. In the 2000s, they were 6.27%. And in the 2010s, they were 4.09%. So we're just barely above you know, what was the absolute lowest decade of interest rates going all the way back to the 1970s. So the real question is, what should you do in your specific situation when it comes to trying to buy a home? Some people say, oh, I'll just wait for interest rates to go down. Well, we have no idea when or if that's gonna happen. And in the interim, at least here in the national middle Tennessee market, prices are continuing to go up really, really quickly. So for most people waiting for interest rates to possibly maybe come down, it may not be the best strategy. It may not be the best for you. Um, it's really important for us to have a conversation and to get a lender involved to really look at your financial situation and look at everything from different standpoints. What are you paying in rent? What would you be paying in a mortgage? Um, are you ready to move forward now? I'm here to just help you make the best decisions possible and to make any process as easy and as seamless as possible to get you into your new home. So if you're thinking about buying in the Middle Tennessee area, reach out to me. Let's just have a conversation. I'm here to help you figure out what's best for you.